Hello and welcome to our behavioral statistics course using the Canvas Learning Management System. There's two main ways to get into our course. One is in the dashboard approach or the other is a calendar. In the dashboard view, you'll see the course card that represents our class and on it is a little announcement icon with the number six next to it, indicating that there are six new announcements awaiting our attention. In the calendar view, we can see all the assignments that are going to be graded. Any of the assignments that you've already accomplished will have a line drawn through them. Let's take a look at the quiz for Module 4A. By clicking on it, you can go directly into the quiz, or if you haven't yet prepared for it, you may decide to go to the module uh, and land on any one of these pages. Let's go to the start of the module, the instructor's note. So a module has an instructor's note, which is an overview of the mo learning module and a heads up if any new information you should be aware of. A reading to discover, which will list the different critical thinking questions you'll need to answer at the end, as well as a reading assignment. Lecturettes, which consist of both YouTube videos as well as web pages. The optional recorded class lessons, which are recording of lessons given in the class. A self-evaluation, which is a non-graded quiz that you can take multiple times for feedback, as well as additional instruction that will give you assistance with the questions that you missed. You can then take the quiz itself. And finally, there is the journal assignment where you'll respond to the critical thinking questions. Let's head back to the dashboard view and enter our course by clicking on the course card. When we do that, we'll go to the home page for our course. And you can see it lists each of the different modules for the class. And we can click on any one of these modules directly enter it. Let's go ahead and click on our welcome orientation course resources. Here you can see our video that provides the introduction to our course. If we click on Ask a Question, this goes over the directions of how to use our Ask a Question, where you can post a question and either the instructor or your fellow students can respond and assist you with any questions you might have. There's the tab for tutoring uh, to get assistance from the tutoring center. Uh, from the student help desk, you can click on Help Desk. Our free uh, e-workbooks are available by clicking on the e-workbooks tab and additional resources can be uh, viewed by clicking on resources information. As you can see, Canvas gives you a number of ways to get into our course material. There is a dashboard bringing you a home page. There is a calendar bringing you to a particular assignment. There's also modules. Modules will list for you all the different available modules and also show you all the pages within the module. And this is a way to enter directly to any particular page that you like as well. Sometimes you won't be able to start a module until you fulfilled a prerequisite. So for this module, it says prerequisite notices and resources for our course, and which was needed to be accomplished was to view the welcome and orientation and uh, class resources. That opens up this module here, how we use statistics. This uh, module, as you can see, is a prerequisite for the graded assessments in it. So before you could take either the quiz or do the journal, you have to fill the prerequisite, which is to view each of these pages. And the purpose of this is just to help you become familiar with the class. After that first learning module, all the subsequent modules do not have prerequisites, and you can enter into it at any point that you so wish. Okay, to wrap up our course tour, let's over and take a look at syllabus. The syllabus provides a link to our course syllabus. There's also an embedded syllabus, a list of our exam dates, and the assignments summary which again provides you the ability to click on any one of these assignments. And then from there, you can either immediately do the assignment or go to the appropriate page in the learning module. Next to the grades, you'll see that there's a one here. And that just shows us that there is one graded assignment that we haven't yet seen the grade for. And by clicking on this, we can see how we did on it. All right, wishing you the very best with this course. And if you have any questions, let me know.